Police are investigating a suspicious death in upscale River Hills. Officers are still there and have been since last night. Our Jonah Kaplan is live now from River Hills with more. Hi, Jonah. Susan, police just handed me this piece of paper here with some really relevant information. First of all, let me tell you where we are. This is River Hills. It's a kind of a posh North Shore neighborhood. Homes are more like estates. They're two to three acres. You can see behind me the police officer, and you could see the crime scene tape blocking the driveway to three different homes. We're in the 8300 block of Range Line, right near Brown Deer. Now let's get to the information, the new information. We can confirm that one person died in what seems to be a car crash. This is video from the scene last night. Officers arrived at about 7 o'clock. They're invite it was one car. We're told we weren't told yet about the uh, how the car crashed or anything like that. What is the extent of the damage? But that's what we know right now, and police continue to call this suspicious. That is now police. First, it was a medical examiner calling suspicious. Now, police officers on scene telling us it's suspicious. So, to recap, we're in a North Shore neighborhood, a lot of trees, uh, very rural area, big estates. We have one car crash and one person dying, and that's the only vehicle that seems to be involved at this time. As more information becomes available, we will share that with you. We're live here in River Hills. Jonah Kaplan, today's TMJ4. Wait, so Jonah, let's understand this. They have an area sure. to homes blocked off, but we're saying that this is a car crash. It's a car crash involving someone at the home. So. We don't really know the circumstances behind it. We mm. just know that it's someone who died in a car. Now, would they have pulled out, crashed into a tree? Maybe they ran into a tree? I mean, no one knows. Okay. Uh, but if you remember, even Tiger Woods on his property, he was in a car crash. Mm. So it could be anything. Interesting. Okay, Jonah, thanks so much. We'll uh, look for updates from Jonah all morning here on Live at Daybreak. The man who